Hello YouTube. So we just got the patch notes for tomorrow's update. It's the Halloween update. I will be reading through it uh, for the most part, so pay attention. And we got a new Cordy costume. It looks like this. Like the Vegas with the pumpkin head. So let's get into the patch notes. Players can obtain various Halloween rewards by staying logged in for 30 minutes every day for 15 days. On the 15th day, players can re obtain Lucky jack o lantern bo necklace box. The box may contain plus 9 necklace on a random chance. So I'm assuming everybody's um, box will be different. Like, mine might be like a plus 5, and someone else's might be like a plus 8 or something. On the 1st and the 8th day, players can obtain Halloween Cordy Hitband box. Jack o' Lantern box contains single property scroll of 85 Prima GC Club one day, two, um, 1x GP random prop form, 1x event festival entry ticket, 1x hero dungeon entry ticket, 1x champion mode ticket, nether rings 3x, and 5x mystery potions. I personally think they need to buff the mystery potions. In the old Grand Chase, those potions would um, heal you if you were cursed or petrified. And I think every large pot needs to get buffed, especially the MP pots, because they are pretty bad at a high level. Halloween Zombie Hunt Mission Halloween Zombies will appear from all Harrier Dungeons and No More Dungeons at the appropriate level range. I will be farming Zora Border because I'm not playing Red Hoyer unless I'm playing with like a friend. But anyways, by defeating zombies, players can obtain Jack o' Lantern Box and Jack o' Lantern Fragments. Actually, Dr. Kunat can drop I mean, um, have a chance of the zombies as well at the first portal. Anyways, Jack o' Lantern Box can. I read this already. And you get the 5x potions and all that crap. Jack o' Lantern Fragments can be used to craft Jack o' Lantern Necklace Box, Halloween Cordy Hitman Box, Zing Shi Hollow Ghost, and 100 GP coupons. Park Elven Forest. Halloween festival. Halloween festival will take place at the park in Elven Forest. Wait, so the, we can craft the Jingxin stuff now. This is like the the, Hado, like the Chinese New Year stuff, I believe. I don't think this is what they're talking about. I'm not sure. If it is, then I might just grab for it. It looks like something you buy from the shop. But anyway, it's Lucky Jack O' Lantern necklace box. Encore, or Encore, I'm gonna call it. Pet Trickster card, it's the ghost pet. We come Cordy set. This is from last year, this is from last year, and this is from last year. I have this on my army. I'm not gonna buy any of these for my glass because I don't like that. I might just get the, like this, I might fuse for that because that looks cool. I think this is. There's more. We're getting discounts. So I'm going to start all the way at the bottom because I'm stupid. Um, Welcome Grand Chase special package at the limit. You know, limited package that contains seal breakers, 150x, advanced ruins, um, X15, single prop 1, 15 GP props, 30% discount. Can only be purchased three times during the set period. This was super expensive the last time we had this. It was like 27 bucks or 30 something bucks. Um, this is for a fourth job package. You can buy the fourth job cheaper. You get one day G premium GC club, 10 days. Wait. Yeah, you get one um, X GC premium for 10 days. Third job, this is on discount. Second job is on discount. Additional backspace. If you missed the battle power event, then that sucks. I guess you got to buy it or something. Premium GC Club seven days. I wish they sell like the GC necklace. You get it for, like thirty days or something like that. No one uses GC necklace anymore because it's so rare. No one wants.
mean, but yeah, um, I guess I digress from that. Make sure you guys like the video, subscribe if you're new, and 